You're listening to The Average Joe Movie Show, where Average Joes review the latest DVDs that have come out as if anyone cared about their opinion. This show is brought to you by the FSA Stock Exchange, where you can buy and sell your favorite movies, actors, athletes, musicians, and more. Visit www.fsastockexchange.com and sign up for a free account. Oh, welcome to The Average Joe Movie Show. I'm Jeremy. This over here is Zach. Brand. And I'm Justin. And we are going to review the movie Ghost Writer. Not to be confused with Rider. Writer. No, also not confused with PBS. <laughs> yeah. PBS! That makes sense. No. <laughs> did you guys watch that though? Or did you know yes, I did. I don't know what you're talking They would like uh, solve mysteries. Yeah, it was like at the after school special. I never watched right. PBS I'm unless it sure was like the Bloodhound game. No, no, no. no. Also <laughs> good. Oh, yeah, I did. But they had the the, like the notebook and it would open and then the ghost, and the ghost writer would come and give them clues. Yeah. Oh, wait. You're talking about the white guy with the. I, I mean, you have the, the white hood. No, that's, that's, that's. White hood? That's, <laughs> that's ghost. He but, interviewed yeah, David. He was like David Letterman for superheroes. Yeah, what was his name? That was the uh, space ghost. ghost. Space, space ghost. ghost. Coast to coast, space ghost. Right? No, Ghost Rider. Yeah. I guess was, I don't remember that a, show on PBS. Okay. okay. All right, so apparently who's in it is. Uh, it's not a spin off. No, <laughs> no, it's just a <laughs> spin off. All right, this is what it's about. It's got Ewan McGregor in it. I like Ewan McGregor. Pierce Brosnan. Also oh, Pierce Brosnan. Okay. Okay. All right, Pierce Brosnan plays a former. Uh, minister yeah. or uh, whatever the British Prime Minister. Oh, I'm like, like, like minister, pastor. Whatever they have in Britain. So is this yeah. a British movie? The, well, it's got these British actors, but it's in America because that's where he's at. Oh. So apparently, he went along with the United States president and got them into a war. That is this? Was, wait, is this a newer movie first? Yeah. Okay. I don't know when it came out, but 2010. Yeah. Oh, so. So, so they're not real happy with him, but he, you know, he thought it was a good decision to do, and he went to war, and and so he's over in the United States. He's writing a book. He's writing his memoirs. Can you do memoirs? And he's writing his memoirs. It says it almost word for word. But what I Did mean, you just uh, read this? <laughs> it's impressive. <laughs> of a former British prime minister. Can you count toothpicks if we drop the box I on can. the floor? <laughs> You're good, man. You're good. Two. Does he uncover secrets that put his own life in jeopardy? He does. And done. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I never saw that on PBS. <laughs> That's for sure. So basically, he's supposed to be writing. So there's been a, a ghostwriter writing before, and he dies. He falls off the ferry or something out in the ocean. Oh, you mean he fell off Right, the right. So you and McGregor's character comes in. So oh, it's really oh, secretive. He's ghostwriting for he's the ghostwriting for the prime yeah, minister. Got it. Mm-hmm. And so he's trying to figure out, you know, and he wants he can't take the manuscript off the island. He can't, you know, he can't do use a flash drive. There's all the security and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So he's trying to figure out one why this other ghostwriter died and what's the big deal. You know why? Why you can't take it? Yeah. Why? Well, and why is it? Why is there the secretive stuff going on? They're going to so, publish the book anyway. Yeah. Yeah. So he's. So he's as he's writing, he uncovers some things, and then there's some twists with the prime minister's wife and mm, stuff like that. Right. And so I know it has Eli Wallach. Yeah. Who's Eli Wallach? He was in the Good, the Bad, and the Ugly. He's an old man. The Magnificent Seven. What's his character? In this? He's old, old man. That's <laughs> all <laughs> so it says. Old man. <laughs> you don't have no idea. No. He's probably some old man in the sidelines. <laughs> <He's> like, <"Hey!" laughs> You kids. Imagine one line. Shut it, old man. <laughs> yeah, so he, I wanna be I wanna be that old man though. I totally do. Totally yeah, yeah. Totally agree. Like, oh old man Patty's out on his porch again. <laughs> I'm going inside. <laughs> I heard that <laughs> With me though, just shake just run, he can't ten- catch you. Shaking yeah. your cane with the tennis balls on it. <laughs> <laughs> of course you wouldn't get it that high then. <laughs> So pretty. I mean, is it suspense? There's some suspense, suspense thriller. Or it wasn't. Was it? Yeah, yeah. Is it, it wasn't as suspenseful as it could have been. Could have been. But see, there's. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna kind of spoil a little bit. Just. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. What? See, it's, I do it before I actually spoil. <laughs> yeah. Good point. My kids are now away. <laughs> but he uncovers some information that makes it look like that he was recruited. The prime minister was recruited by the FBI or the CIA back when he was in college. 
And so, so and that's where sad. the prime minister and his wife met. And so he's kind of talking to the wife, trying to figure out, you know. So they're thinking that maybe he was made, he's he like, be, they made him become the prime minister so that the United States could get what they want. So he's trying to figure that all out. That sounds about right. And stuff like that. So. Okay. So there's a little bit of sus- suspense, but otherwise it was pretty slow. And kind of I was going to say, on, on the slow yeah, rainy season. It was just kind of just plain. It was done up in, in like Maine or whatever yeah. during the rainy season. So, so it's just, great. Everything's yeah, it's just slow gray and, and gross. And that's where their house is. It's out on the ocean. Sand everywhere. And that's too bad because I like you, McGregor. And yeah. I think Pierce Brosnan does a great... He's probably the Prime Minister, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he plays a great pompous British guy, so... Because so, yeah. he is. Yeah. I mean, sure he doesn't have to do much. Yeah. He's acts like he's up. <laughs> we still would love Oh, jeez, it's like, like oh. on the Today Show. <laughs> <laughs> and Curry, who was it? I'll get it. It's probably for me. Someone from Area Coach 586. Anybody know where Eric goes to 586 is? You gotta answer that and put it on speaker when we talk to him. This is Justin. Hello? For legal purposes, you have to tell them they're part of the NHL. You should tell them. You should tell them. I think they're calling from yeah. like Nigeria or something. They are participating. Is it the prince? He, could, he emails me all the time. <laughs> he can tell. He needs to, he needs to, he needs to get out of prison. I keep sending him info. I, mean, uh, I apologize for that interruption. <laughs> How rude. So yeah. So. Ghost writer. See it if you're bored. Hey, maybe and that's then, one of our viewers calling. And then if you... <laughs> To talk oh, to us. I want to get bored. You should watch, watch, it, watch it again. It. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because it's kind of boring. Mm. It's okay, but you, I don't know. It's kind of predictable in my book. So. So if you're watching and you get bored, yeah. you start it over. Yeah. So if you just want to be miserable and Hopefully have to make sanity, you, you can like flip the dial. <laughs> you get so over. bored yeah. that you get excited. Yeah. <laughs> like it can't get much worse. I'll just watch it again. <laughs> and if it gets worse. So I don't, I don't think exactly. So it's probably not. It's gone a, down, though, because when you started, it was almost I know. like it was like, oh, I see yeah. how I made it. Isn't that amazing how these really things evolve? <laughs> and none of us have seen it, so we didn't even add anything. So I'm assuming that it was Kyle, and we shouldn't watch it. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Would you rather watch Ghost Rider the movie or Ghost Rider the, epi- the TV episode? Or Space Ghost Coast Coast. I don't know the TV episode. Space Ghost Coast to Coast. I'll throw that in there just to. Yeah, because that was fun. Did yeah. he just interview yeah. Space or Star Wars? He, he was also. He, he had his own show for a while. Yeah, back when. See, apparently, our cartoons were in color. Back when cartoons weren't made of When they were just barely out of drawings. Yeah. Do you remember that? When I started. He had something psychic, too, right? Oh, yeah. Space Do you remember the. Yes, exactly. Yeah. And I'm old. Wow. See here, look. Me too, apparently. <laughs> yeah, but I'm not that old. And look. <laughs> Are we all about the same age except for you? Oh, no, I'm old. Right. Close? 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 It's like 50, 40, 30, 20. Whatever. <laughs> Is this Are you the down? same Should age be. as me? <laughs> 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 yeah. if you, if you, all right, here we go. If you have to watch this movie while you're doing some work, you'll get your work done. Oh, I should that is a good queue. way to. That's yeah. a good way to rate things. There's something to go in the background. Yeah, I don't really care. Great background noise. I yeah. should put that. Cool. Thank you. All right then. All right. Well, that's sad. If work is better than I know. That that's movie. kind of what you did. Anyway, anyway. sorry. Right. I should. Do you want me to tell you how? Let's not cut that yet. Yeah. Work would always be better. <laughs> <laughs> the prime minister was gay. Yeah.